Evangelical Alliance of Kenya has cautioned against early campaigns and instead asked the government to fulfill promises made to Kenya during campaigns. The clergymen want the president to address the runaway corruption, high cost of living among many challenges facing Kenyans. It continues to undermine our development and erode the public trust. The government's failure to decisively punish corrupt officials and recover stolen public funds is unacceptable. There seems to be a general feeling from Kenyans that the top leadership is involved in corruption and that's why it is condoning this evil and shielding those who are found culpable, which may not be the case. It is time to walk the talk and be seen to slay the dragon of corruption in our country. Bold action is needed to restore integrity and confidence in governance and ensure justice for all citizens. The recent heated political events have left the nation deeply polarized. For example, what happened in Moranga. This should not be repeated. The president must prioritize fostering unity and reconciliation. It's a symbol of unity in this country. Is it possible for all political rallies and early campaigns to be stopped at this time to avoid what we saw in Moranga and some other places? During the campaign time, the president promised Kenyans a lot of things. The expectations of Kenyans were raised. The reality is that all could not be fulfilled at once. We advise as the clergy, the president, if possible, to avoid making more promises at this time and instead focus in prioritizing flagship projects at those areas that are closer to the hearts of Kenyans and focus on delivering results of achievements. At this time, we need to have a scorecard of what has been achieved.